Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So it appears that my console table has been delivered and I wanted to kind of keep you guys here and like set it up. I finally got my mirror from Amazon for the entryway area and I want to unbox it because tonight is trash night. There's one issue that I'm having. It says wall mirror on the box, but there's nowhere on the box. I see that it says fragile. This is the last thing. Oh my God, it's kind of heavy. This is the last thing I bought for the entryway because um, the other thing that I bought is coming soon. Which is two ottomans. The other day when my mom was packing our boxes, Mr. saw two huge boxes downstairs. My mom's boxes. I heard him telling my mom that he saw the boxes and he was like, I know this woman didn't buy this big. How are we gonna get this upstairs? I'm like, wow, they really think I have a problem. Oh, it's in one piece, not broken. That is beautiful. that on the wall, it's so heavy. I don't think I can manage to put it on the wall. I thought I would have been able to put it up now, but I would be fooling myself thinking I could put that up on my own. And a heavy. Where did I just put the tape? I'm so ready to take this rubber off, but it's in the recording. Thank you. I know that he's gonna be extremely pissed when he comes here later and sees the massive boxes. Maybe I should show y'all so you can see how bad it is. I'm also wrapping gifts for his birthday, which by the time this video goes up, his birthday would have been gone. But um, here are our boxes that we've accumulated for about a week and a half since my mom has been here. So the mirror is supposed to be going on the wall right here. Imagine the box is gone and the mirror is nice and on the wall. Can we imagine? Yes. Okay. So guys, I wanted to buy a new table that's a little bit higher and I was searching and searching and everything was six and seven hundred that I liked. I'm going to pop a picture of like what I'm looking for and like what I like on the screen so you guys can see. And then I remember that I have this table that is actually solid wood, right? Everything that I was seeing was not solid wood. And then I realized that I could wrap it with contact paper and buy some legs on Amazon to make the table a little bit more high because at least I know the table fits in the space. It's a good size for the space and it's a good quality. And it was not, I think it was a hundred and something dollars. It definitely was not no $600. So I'm like, oh my gosh. So I was looking on Amazon and I bought some legs. And it took my coworker telling me that she doesn't have any space to fit this on. Because initially she was going to take it. Because um, I told her that I was throwing it out. And she said, when she evaluated her apartment, she didn't have any space to hold it. So I'm going to have to keep it. And I'm like, damn, I was so disappointed. I kid you not. And then while I'm going through, I'm like, hold on. All I'm seeing is like a table on some fancy legs that I like. I could literally put my table on the fancy legs that I like. But I decided that I'm going to go ahead and wrap the table. And I'm gonna wrap it with this contact paper. Guys, that is what the table looks like. When it is done, the legs are gonna come off, but the top is completely done. This side, I'm gonna do a little bit of work too. But for the most part, the top is literally done. Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Yet another solo project. So yesterday I started this project where I was wrapping the top of my table because I knew that I was gonna get these legs for my table. These are almost the same height as the actual countertop. It's just shy of maybe two inches, which for me, that's great. This is almost at my waist. 
okay? So this is good. So what I'm gonna do is attempt to screw these brand new legs onto the table. Even though honestly, I bought some gold spray paint and I wanted to spray paint them, but at this rate, the spray paint is probably gonna take forever to dry and I'm not really in the mood to go through all of that. So I just wanna, I probably just wanna put them on as is. But then I went ahead and got myself this pink drill. Are you kidding me? How cute is that? This is so stunning because I'm doing all these projects and I just feel like I have to put this on my Insta stories. This is absolutely stunning. Are you kidding me? My phone. I might have to charge it. Oh yeah, there's no charge. You guys, I completely forgot to show y'all because I was messing around trying to figure out how to use my new drill. I just remembered that I didn't show y'all. But anyways, I measured the legs, put them on there, and like started screwing them down. But as you can see, the difference in, in like the length of the legs, so that's great. So I'm just putting in the last four screws right now. Screws, and I'm glad that they actually sent the legs with screws, with screws because I was a little bit worried. And then I'm gonna take these legs off and we're gonna see how it works. So I'm gonna unscrew those and come back. So guys, this is absolutely the moment of truth because I took the other legs off and now I need to turn it over to, you know, see what's really up with, with, with this. And I'm really hoping that it's everything that I had in my mind because I don't have another plan, quite literally. And I took those legs off and I don't feel like screwing them back on. So we're praying that this works once. Oh my God, it's kind of heavy. I love it. I freaking love it. So guys, it's definitely high and I love that. But now I need to buy the bar stools for sure, for absolute certain. But oh my gosh, who do I think I am? Whoever that is, I love her. Because what? Are you absolutely kidding? So the chairs are gonna now have to go on the front. And obviously these chairs we can no longer use because they're so much shorter. I mean, you could probably use them for the next, you know, but they're obviously like short. So I was looking at some bar stools and it's absolutely time to get those because she's ready. Yet another successful project, love this. So here's how this is gonna work now. Let me move this to kind of give you guys a vision, all right? Now that it's done, runner for sure, because we love a runner. And then we're gonna go through bowl. Obviously it looks a little sad right now, but just imagine, imagine this with fresh fruits. Absolutely stunning. This is exactly the vision that I had in mind. When I get the bar stools, <coughs> they're gonna go at the front here. I could still have a bar stool at the sides here, <coughs> but love this, love this. This is how high I want it to be. Look. See, now I can put you guys down on the table. I love this. I absolutely love this. Are you kidding me? And when I do buy them expensive ass bar stools, I'm gonna keep them forever because you guys, bar stools are so expensive. Bar stools are expensive. Oh my God. Imagine this table when I put my, my Christmas centerpiece on there this high. I'm definitely gonna get the bar stools by Christmas. And then over in that corner, I'm gonna get like a pantry from Ikea to put there. So nothing is gonna be exposed over on that side. Absolutely freaking amazing. I'm so excited. But for now, that's where we're gonna leave you guys because there has to be another episode. Or maybe I'll save this and just add it to something else, but freaking amazing. Hi y'all, I got my bar stools. We're gonna try to like set them up. You know what? I'm gonna put y'all on this other tripod. I couldn't fit on the tripod, so. Here we are. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, you guys, these are so nice. 
god, I love it. You guys. I'm very high off the ground, I'll tell you that. Yes. You guys, I love it. I'm gonna put the other one together. See y'all later. <laughs> it is so cute. I couldn't be happier with one purchase, okay? So we're gonna set the other one up and then I'm gonna come back and show you guys a little video on the table.